Hi, my name is Magisha. Today we're here at the CL London Academy. It's A-level results in 2015 and the students have been working really hard all throughout the year. And now they're here today to see if their hard work has paid off and if they got their first choices in their next level of study. Um, I'm very happy to say that I've got into university and I got three A stars. Well, they were very good. I got two A stars and two A's. I'm going to go home and celebrate my grades and just be happy that this is all over. So I heard that, you know, you got 100% in your F exam. So how did, how did you do that? Um, I revised really hard for it and I went to my um, ethics teacher before the exam so that she can give me exam structure and how to answer the question efficiently and, and I applied that to the exam. Overall really, really exciting. 100% pass rate for all of our students. Considering the backgrounds of our students, they're very diverse. Um, for many of our students, it's the first generation of going to university and a lot of them from different pathways. The success rates of vocational pathway, I'm incredibly proud of our students. We have two vocational students going off to university, one of them studying mechanical engineering and then some specific uh, success with Sonna, Dennis and Sean all going to UCL to study maths. So the combination of eight A stars all together and then our first vet student with Rachel Tran going off to the Royal Veterinary College which is really exciting. I'm really proud of all of them. Well the teachers helped a lot. They're, they are amazing teachers and they like they give me extra help if I need it. If I didn't understand the homework or something I can go to them straight away and talk like friends really. We have a very good relationship. Being in a small further mass class it's brought like, us close. We could revise together. Everyone could help each other. I see Mr Blessing and Mr Nathan worked with the physics department calling in like old students to help me with my grade to push it up. Well, I have to credit Miss Matthews the most because even though I did get a B in psychology, she helped me so much and she spent so many hours of her time reading past papers and all that kind of stuff that she really didn't have to do, so I really appreciate that. Students from COLA have a wide range of talents and aptitudes, which is shown in the diversity of the subjects taken by the students, as well as the varieties of higher education, apprenticeships and other courses they have worked so hard to get into. I got a distinction in science and a distinction star in ICT. I got a distinction star in ICT. Yeah, I'm going Hertfordshire to study automotive engineering with motorsport. I'm going to Angular Rusk in Chelmsford to study business information systems. And I'm going to King's College London and then hopefully um, do something alongside politics or journalism when I'm older. So I'm planning to study mathematics at UCL. And then I don't know where it's going to take me, but I'll probably go into engineering or finance. I know that the city are really delighted with uh, the Southwark Academy. We've got three academies, but this is the one we have in the South London. And so for the community around Bermondsey and Peckham and this area, and the city is very glad to be involved with this area and to support local uh, people. Hello, Mr Bannister. Just wanted to find out what's your reaction to the A-level results this year. How are you, how are you feeling? I'm just, uh, well I'm over the moon for our students, I'm over the moon that we have our best ever um, A-level results, that the students have been um, so successful and there are so many happy and smiling faces uh, around the academy today. Again, that marks also you know, the teaching staff's success, our community's success uh, and also the City of London's success. And what do you think is the key to success at this academy? I think it's about a combination of partnership working, working in partnership with the students, working in partnership with the staff uh, and also with parents as well but it is about young people having aspirations, wanting to achieve and being resilient when they get the knockbacks in life because you know those do come but it is about picking yourselves back up, moving forward and having really high aspirations it is about self-esteem and believing in who they are uh, and believing that they can do it and today has proven that our students can go on and be really really successful. So on behalf of the City of London Academy Southwark and the City of London Corporation, we want to congratulate all of our students on their fantastic results and we wish them the very best for the future.